Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel, my YouTube video. So today I'm going to be doing a little drawing. Um, when I first started this drawing, I had no plans whatsoever besides I think it would be cool to make, because I'd like to do little doodles of myself. So I thought it'd be kind of cool to do little doodles kind of all over a page and kind of messy, but also do like a clean border on the outside. So that's what the tape is for. So you'll have to excuse me. I'm a little bit sick right now and I sound very off. This is not what I normally sound like at all. And I feel like I'm getting kind of out of breath just from talking. So yeah, I don't really know. I don't really know what I'm going to be talking about um in this like voiceover but i guess i'm just gonna talk and see what happens so this actually took me way longer than i thought it was going to but i feel like that's typically always the case whenever it comes to stuff that i'm working on like i was like okay i'm just gonna draw for like maybe an hour or two no, I think this may have taken me like four hours at least because when I was putting this video together and I was putting all the clips together and stuff, it was like I had to put the speed, like the video was so long, I'm gonna be honest. Okay, it was not four hours. That was a lie, actually. That was an over-exaggeration. It may have been, I don't know how long it was. Maybe like two hours? Okay. Yeah, I forgot completely how long it was. Anyways, but it took me way longer than expected. That's for sure. Actually, you know what? I think this may have taken me a couple days. It's been it's been like maybe a week or two since I last worked on it. So I can't remember anything anymore. But um yeah. And I've been obsessed with doodling like these round stars oh my gosh i think they're the cutest thing ever so i've been obsessed with doing it like that um and then i guess the way i draw myself this is sort of like my my art persona i guess you can say like this is how i draw myself in my sketchbooks and stuff for like if i want to write down my like a little thought bubble of what I thought I did for the sketch. So then I draw myself like this with like sweatshirt and jeans on because I feel like that's typically my go-to. I'm a big sweatshirt person. I love wearing sweatshirts. So yeah, but I've been obsessed with the shape of a star for maybe the past year or so. It's kind of weird, but also I feel like everybody's been liking the shape of the star. So maybe I'm just, going with the trends who knows but um yeah and then also so this is no this isn't my first video with the new camera but this is my first time using the camera to try to record myself drawing something and i did not have a little camera stand yet for this video so i'm using i <laughs> i used a glass cup and i set the camera up on the glass cup so that's why the angles suck so bad. And that's why the lighting sucks so bad. But don't worry guys, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. And then also this little like wood easel thing that I got. I got that at five below for like five bucks. And I like it. I think it's pretty cool how I don't know, I like being able to prop up my sketchbook like that and stuff. I feel like it, I don't know what I feel like it does, but I feel like it feels better than drawing flat. Um, and then here I am, I'm going through filling in all the little spaces cause I got kind of tired of uh, doodling myself. So I just decided to put little, little stars everywhere. I thought it was really cute. Um, yeah. And then also while I was working on this, I went through my Micron pens. I only have like five, but then I realized that like two of them are dead. I was like, I don't remember really using them that much. Why are they dead already? I don't understand. 
but I just went ahead and bought some more because I actually, I, I understand, I think I'm starting to understand the hype behind Micron pens now. They're really nice. And I feel like they dry pretty nicely too. And it's like such a nice solid black that doesn't look faded at all. So I think I really like that. And then now what I'm doing in this, in the, in the video is I'm going back around the bigger stars and I'm just doing a darker outline just because I thought it looked cool. And also um, I'm constantly learning that line weight and line variation in a piece really gives more visual interest for sure. So yeah, that's fun. Um, I think I'm gonna end this here for the voiceover part and just let you enjoy the rest of the video, I guess. Oh, another thing, my friend, I posted it like on my private account and my friend said that it would make a cool tote bag or a t-shirt and I kind of agree, but like, I guess let me know if you'd be interested in that maybe i'd make it happen even if nobody said that they were interested in it because i do think this would be really cool as a t-shirt actually maybe i'll do it okay i'm gonna let you enjoy the rest of the video and enjoy the rest of the music i guess um okay bye